What's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your boy Joe. Come back at you with another video. So, if you guys watched my earlier video, I showed you guys how to wash your beard. And uh, now in this one, I'm going to be showing you guys how to apply beard balm. I got it right here. This is, some, this is a Walmart style beard balm because I don't have the type of money to fork over to get balm from like these big name uh, companies and stuff like that. Um, but it's pretty much all the same. I mean, I have used it, but uh, oh, I also want to show you guys this. Uh, this is a shirt my nephew got me for Christmas. It says, only the best uncles have beards. So, anyway, I just thought that was kind of cute. And I thought, hey, I might as well wear it since I'm doing a video about beards today. So, anyway, here we go. Okay, so, if you open it up, unscrew it. I've used it a bit. You can see that it's it's a hard uh, surface type thing. So, but before we get into it, I want to also explain to you guys... When applying product to your beard, you want to make sure that it is um, about uh, very light, damp. Uh, you don't want it to be completely dry because you want to do it when you first get out, when you get out of the shower. Um, and you also want to make sure that you get dressed also because you don't want to put a shirt on and have like balm all or oil or whatever you're using, cream, something. You want to make sure that it does, you don't get it all down in your shirt and stuff like that because it's gross. Um, not that it's gross in the sense that, anyway, it's just, just get dressed first before you start applying stuff. Um, so how you do this is you take it like this. You can, now there are two ways to get balm out of the container when it's a hard style of balm. And I actually prefer this type of uh, balm instead of the creamy kind. Uh, one, because I feel like it lasts longer and two, you're not tempted to use as much. Um, so anyway, so, uh, there's two ways you can get it out. You can take two fingers and rub it on there and melt it, or you can take the back of your thumb and scrape it across. Uh, either way works fine. You wind up getting this about all, like almost the same amount, um, but I feel like if you want to, if you're in a hurry, you don't want to wait as long, uh, or if you're just impatient, oops, sorry guys, or if you're just impatient like me, um, I prefer to use the back of my thumb to get the ball out and hold on a second. There we go, okay, sorry guys. So anyway, I prefer, I prefer using the back of my thumb to get it out. Okay, so take your take the back of your thumb, just go one pass right over the top. You want to apply medium to light to medium pressure on it, um, so you get about that much out of there. Okay, so you take your finger, scrape it off the back of your thumb. Make sure you get all of it off there. You're gonna you're gonna wind up washing your hands anyway. Take it, put it on your palm like that, and then take it and rub your palms together. Your hands will be turn out to be shiny. You can't really see that that well. But your hands will be shiny. You'll start smelling it because it's melted. You don't want to rub it too much because you don't want to uh, have it go in your hands, which does happen sometimes. You also don't want to wait too long to apply it. So then what you do, almost the same technique that you use uh, when you're washing your beard. So I go side to side just like this. I come across the front, go down. I have a mirror here. I'm not doing this blind. Go down just like that. And that's really all there is to it. Make sure it's all off your hands, as much as you can get off your hands. Just like that. All right. Now you can <clears throat> put the lid back on. You're done with that. Now, wash your hands. Wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands. Why do I say that? Because you don't want to forget to wash your hands after applying that. Which I've done a few times. Okay, let me dry my hands real quick. Why do you wash your hands? Um, one, you don't want to forget. Two, um, if you start touching your face and stuff, because it, it is an oil-based, uh, balm is an oil-based product. And when you have oil and balm or creams or whatever, there are still oils in them. And you could get acne, you could give other people acne. It's just best if you just wash your hands right there. Okay, so now you have three choices, because you're not done, you're not done. You have three choices. You can either A, use your boar brush, which I do not ever use for, um, spreading it you can it doesn't hurt it i just feel like it 
it causes like gunk and stuff to get in there and it's just a bad time. Um, you can use a brush, which is the one that I mainly use, or you can use a comb. Brush and comb are your best because they're easier to clean out and uh, I feel personally like they spread the stuff better. Especially when you have a longer beard, this doesn't get under here as much and you want it to get all evenly. So I'm actually going to use the brush today. I'm going to show you guys how to use the comb in a second. So literally it's just as simple as brushing. Make sure you push it down and back because you want to get it all in there. And then just shape it how you want it. I like, I like kind of having like a rounded bottom for my beard. Good, just like that. Now, if you're going to use a comb, what you do is you take the comb, you press the teeth inward, just like this, and you go down. You don't want to go down, you don't want to have the teeth, teeth down like that, because what, what that'll do is you'll see balm get caught up in here, and it'll push it all out. And it's just the same way you use a comb as you do for a brush. You just... Take the teeth, keep them inward, and even as you go underneath here, then you just shape it how you want. You can even take your hands, because now the balm is spread in there pretty well at this point, that you don't have to worry about uh, it getting on your hands as much, and you just shape how you want it. All right, and that's it. That's all there is to it, guys. Oh. Anyway, guys, so hope you guys enjoyed. Hope this helps. If you have any questions about how to apply oils or creams, it's all pretty much the same thing. Um, even how to uh, how to style the beard, and uh, but anyway, guys, if you have any questions about beards or anything else, martial arts, NFL, Cowboys related, feel free to ask. And um, if you have any ideas about what I should do, uh, uh, what else I should do with my channel, you know, leave it down below. Um, but most of all, guys, take care of your beards because they'll help you look so much better. So have a wonderful day. God bless you all. Peace.